Hello friends, good morning. It is, I believe, a Friday morning. Yeah, it's a Friday morning. And as usual, kind of on the way to work, but I didn't have to open this morning. So I'm able to head out quite a bit later. Let's go ahead and get the housekeeping out of the way, shall we? Today, I'm running my Peterson. Uh, it's a Peterson Aaron, and it's shape 106, if you're interested. But, nice little pipe, P-lip. I'm not usually a fan of the P-Lip. I didn't know if I would be or not. Uh, this, actually I bought this and my system pipe at the same time. I'm looking where the camera is not. Um, <laughs> uh, I bought this and my system pipe at the same time. Uh, and I wasn't sure if I was gonna like that P-Lip or not. I'm still kind of on the fence about it. It isn't my favorite, but it isn't bad at all. Um, definitely, if you have a problem with tongue bite, a P-lip is really the way to go because it redirects the smoke towards the roof of the mouth rather than straight to the tongue. <coughs> Excuse me. So if you happen, if you tend to get a lot of tongue bite, uh, especially for beginners, where that kind of thing is is an issue I actually would suggest a p-lip it redirects the smoke to the roof of the mouth it doesn't really affect your tongue you know and kind of help you get get moving through your progress of learning how to smoke a pipe and learning you know what to do but in it today I am running velvet So, ah, what a pleasure. I actually really like velvet. Not as much, obviously, as my Prince Albert, but I really like velvet. Just a real pleasure to smoke. Yes, sir. Today, I'm going to be... <coughs> ah, bless me. Oh, oh. Need a squeegee for my brain off the window for that one. <laughs> um, today, I'm going to be building some walls, but I need to do some box burning, too. It's finally down to a low fire danger and I think I'll be able to burn boxes which really needs to happen like badly Um, but I will be building a couple of walls today. Doing a remodel, or continuing the remodel, I should say. But 
brisk morning this morning. Down in the 40s. I have no idea what it's supposed to get to today. I haven't opened my app yet. But, you know, 8 o'clock in the morning and it's still in the 40s. It's a brisk morning. Still got cloud cover today. It looks like it's there is potential for it to rain, whether it does or not. I'm going to swap windows. Sorry, guys. Whether it actually rains or not is anybody's guess, if you want me to be honest. But, judging by the cloud cover, there is still potential for it. It rained all day yesterday. Heard from my son temporarily yesterday. He was walking between buildings at the base and decided to call me, I guess. Kind of a good feeling on that. But he's enjoying his first station uh, and his technical training. Said his biggest problem is nobody's telling him when to eat, so he keeps forgetting. enjoying it he really likes the life so that's good and he loves learning stuff that he actually didn't know before especially technical information so he's really enjoying what he's doing like in a big way. It's almost moose hunting season. Moose hunting season will come a boost in business, but at the same time, I'd like to get out in the evenings and try and find a moose. Maybe take my boys with me. I used to go out with my dad when I was three and four. So, I don't see why not, as long as I can get them to stop, or at least talk quiet. The youngest one, I'm not sure I can do that, but I'm gonna try. But my daughter has also expressed an interest in going, so who knows. You know, I got to thinking about it. You know, when you're smoking your pipe and you run across blends that you enjoy more and more, <clears throat> you just naturally include those and start moving them into your rotation uh, faster, you know, I mean, much more often. So 
as you get a blend that you really find that you enjoy, you just naturally start moving it into your rotation. I started looking at my tobaccos yesterday because I was packing up, uh, repacking my pouch, my tobacco pouch because I was running out in it and I was looking at possibly changing what I had in there. Because ever since I got it, I've been pretty much keeping Prince Albert in, in my pouch. Because that's like my most used tobacco, right? And uh, I started looking at my others and I'm like, you know, all of these now feel like occasional smokes. I wonder why. And then I what I did was I organized everything so that in one drawer I have the bulk of my tobaccos and then in the other drawer is the tobaccos that I use the most and you know the funny part about that is that almost all of my most used tobaccos my three most used tobaccos are codger blends Prince Albert, Velvet, and Granger. And I thought, well, isn't that interesting? They just, they seem to hit the sweet spot. You know what I'm saying? So apparently, I have become a codger. And I actually have absolutely no problem with that. Swing into the gas station here. What the hell? So as I can pick up a couple of five hours. Found out they're cheaper here than they are at the store. But... I'm thinking real serious about doing a couple of videos, not many, but a couple that are straight up edited videos, you know, so I can kind of string things together. Let me know in, down in the comments if that's something that you would be interested in seeing. <clears throat> so far, I've basically done nothing but one take uh, videos. Mostly because of time constraints. I really don't have the time to do editing. So if I do an edited video, it's likely to be a while before it's the edit gets put up, even though I'm going to continue to do these in the meantime. You know what I'm saying? So if that's something you think you would like to see, just let me know down in the comments, and uh, I'll see what I can put together. But until the next video, take care, y'all. I'm out.